We are going to talk about a movie. This is gonna be a disaster. It was one of the best movies of the year. It's gonna oh. go so well. <laughs> <laughs> Probably one of the last movies I would ever want to see in a theater. What is going on everybody? Taylor here and today I'm going to be watching and reacting to the official teaser trailer for The King which is being produced by Netflix. It stars Timothy Chalamet as King I believe Henry V? Yes, King Henry V. So I'm really really excited to see this. I always um I'm a big fan of Shakespeare adaptations. I think that I was one of the few people in high school who was actually actually interested in Shakespeare. It wasn't always my favorite because sometimes it was tough to get through, but I do love Shakespeare and when there's a good movie adaptation of a Shakespeare play or a good reinterpretation of one, I think that they're fantastic. So. Let's just jump into this and see what this teaser trailer is going to show us. That's a cool shot. Do you feel a sense of achievement? In what regard? In any regard. Do you? Mm. A new chapter of my life has begun. Already I can feel the weight of this crown I wear. I've been forced to rely upon the counsel of men whose loyalty I question every waking moment. I need men around me I can trust. I'm here because you are my friend. King has no friends. King has only followers and foe. There he is. Will come with you. All hail King Henry! Oh, that's awesome. That is a great shot. needed um yeah so <laughs> i think that timothy chalamet is gonna end up wanting gonna end up being one of the most talented um actors of the time i think he's he's relatively close in age to to where i am and i think that in my lifetime he's gonna end up being one of the greats he is just so natural in what he does and he just evokes such powerful emotion in pretty much every role I've seen him in. He completely, completely destroyed me in Call Me By Your Name. He completely destroyed me in, um, oh god, what was that movie with Steve Carell last year where he was completely addicted to drugs? <laughs> I can't I remember what it's called. Um, but he just... Like, I don't think I'll ever be the same after watching that movie that, for some reason, completely, completely escapes me right now. But you guys can look it up. It's him and Steve Carell, and it's one of the most heartbreaking, difficult movies I've ever watched. But anyway, I think that we're going to see so much out of him and his career going forward, and he especially like just watching this trailer he he's so tuned in and it's magnificent and i'm so excited i'm also really excited because joel edgerton is involved ben mendelson is involved robert pattinson is involved this is another movie that just has a powerhouse of a cast and i'm also a big sucker for period pieces in general it doesn't just have to be shakespeare but pretty much anything um, that's considered a period piece is something that catches my attention usually pretty much no matter what. <laughs> so that 
Also, another tick that this movie gets in favor of it. And, I mean, I think that the cinematography is great. Um, I think that, um, I think that this trailer really sets a good tone for what this movie is going to try to achieve. And I think it shows you enough of, of what the story is if you're not familiar with the play Henry V that you'll get a sense of what's going on. Um, obviously he is at a point in his life where he, where it's his turn to take over the crown and he ha has a lot of doubts about the people who surround him. He's very tense and very stressed by the burden of taking on the crown and having to decide who around him he trusts and what the right decisions are. And that, I feel like that's pretty much all that you need to know to go into the story. And that's all that a teaser really needs to tell you. So what do you guys think? Are you excited for this movie? Please leave your thoughts in the comments. As always, all my links are down in the description if you want to find me on social media. My link to my Patreon is also down there. If you would like to check it out, I recently had a new patron, Andy. Thank you so much for your support. Every dollar helps so, so much. Even if you can't donate, if you don't have the budget to donate to my Patreon, just being a subscriber and watching my videos also helps so much and just continues to give me the inspiration to keep going and keep doing what I love. So thank you guys so much for that, and I will see you all next time.